Hey, welcome back! We're still playing XCOM 2 Terror from the Deep! And we've just killed a ship! No, it's not dead yet! It's just asleep! And we're going to recover it now! I believe our sub in the second base over yonder is capable of doing a mission. But whenever we can, we're going to send the first Triton with the guys we already know. Die grenade. I already mentioned once that when I first started playing this game it was together with a friend and we were like maybe 11 or 12 years old and we didn't have the game manual, we knew nothing about it whatsoever. And this is what we used to be doing on the equipment screen. Only those chemical flares I'm using now were like grenades and extra ammo. Useful stuff actually, but we had no idea about strength and maximum carry weight and all that stuff. So, when we sent our soldiers into battle, more than half of them had lost a big amount of time units already, due to too much weight. But it took a long time before we connected the dots, before we realized there was a link between those time units or guys lost and the weight they were carrying. It's just one of many many stupid things we used to do before we understood how the game actually worked. They should put our expendables in the front of the sub. It seems like we've landed in the middle of the map for once. No, that's a corner. Never mind. Sir Dyslot, how nice of you to volunteer as a scout. Great sit, you're not too valuable either. You can go find us some alien bullets. Just prepare the rest of the guys to get outside. And here's our first alien walking into sight. A gill man. Rock. You don't have a grenade anymore. Gary, prepare a grenade for rock. Uh, 
and then rock can throw it. Simple as that. And that's a dead alien. He just doesn't know it yet. Dies a lot. Nothing to see. A red shirt. Nothing here either. This looks like a very small map. Or is it just me? I don't remember what sort of ship we actually shot down. Must have been an escort. Alright, great. Take a shot. You suck. But I believe we already knew that. Rock. Kill that alien. No, no, I meant kill him, hit him, don't scare him away. Tosser, you still have a grenade, yes. Toss it over here. And that's another dead alien. And number three just stepped up. Stepped up. Crate is going to have another go. Trying to fool us into thinking he's actually worth something. And not just full of... ...stuff. Still an alien in the sub. Or that door we just heard was him leaving the sub. These missions seem to be going quicker and quicker for some reason. I believe we are going to play it safe. And if the alien doesn't show up, then we'll just Toss a grenade to the other side. Like so. It's not on the roof, so... Uh-oh. That's strange. There you go. Mission complete. Not much. Back to waiting. Large. Hmm. We cannot take down a large at the moment. But we can go have a look where he's going. Or maybe he already did. 
disappeared. Yeah, he's gone. He probably had already finished his mission when he showed up on the radar. And we finish today by some complete research. They won't tell us what. But I believe it was the sonic cannon clip. And now we start on a deep one corpse. Yep, it was the cannon power clip. We start on the deep one corpse. And a deep one corpse will lead eventually to some better armor for our soldiers. Gauss rifle. One, two, three. One, two, three. Four, five, six. And sonic cannons instead. Do we still have enough pulsers? Yes. Alright. Then we save. And we continue next time. See you then.